Hey everybody, Bearded Fortech here. Welcome back to the channel. I just wanted to go over this uh, TSB here, 23-2367 uh, for the 21 through 23 F150 that has the 400 watt AC DC DC AC uh, inverter system in the bed of the truck. So let's go take a look. All right, see right here at the top of the screen, 21 through 23 F150, 400 watt DC AC inverter system in op with, what is that, a code in there? B1330-9A in the body control module. Let's click on that, take a look. And it's gonna be the 21 through 23 F150. These are gonna be the parts that you need for it. All right, so this is equipped with the 400 watt direct current alternating current inverter system with a pickup bed alternating current power outlet socket may experience the DC AC inverter system inoperative with a diagnostic trouble code B13309A stored in the body control module. This is due to the connection issue at connector 4628. To the correct the condition, follow the service procedure to inspect the connector and secure the harness. So the parts list, that's what it's going to be. A retainer, the auxiliary power outlet, the wire harness. And we're going to take a look down here. And this just gives you your labor times on how to do it. Uh, it's 1.9 hours. Uh, so step one, disconnect the connector and remove the pickup bed AC power outlet harness retainer from the body. This is the harness retainer. This is underneath the bed of the truck. So you're going to unplug it. Using a suitable tool, carefully cut and remove the pickup bed AC power outlet socket harness uh, retainer from the pickup bed power outlet socket harness. Discard the retainer. Uh, inspect the connector. For the presence of corrosion, dirt, and or damage. Is corrosion, dirt, and or damage present? Um, yes. Replace the pickup bed AC power outlet socket assembly. Refer to the workshop manual. No. Proceed to step four. Install a new pickup bed power outlet socket harness retainer. That. Apply electrical grease to the pickup um, socket connector, which would be that, and plug it back in. Basically, all you're going to do. And you're going to zip tie it up out of the way. But if it is corroded or anything like that, you're probably going to have to put a whole new connector on it. Um, we could probably go into the workshop manual 41405. Replace the body side harness assembly of the connector. Okay. So you're going to replace the harness assembly. That's what that's going to be. That's why I said 1.9. That harness is just in a bad spot up inside underneath the bed right there. And that's if you have the power outlets in the bed of the truck. Probably wouldn't hurt to get down there and unplug that and go ahead and check that connector. Um, if you're having any of these problems, if you're not having any of the problems, there's no need to look at it. Don't mess with it. It should be good to go. As always, I love you guys and I'll see you on the next one.